Hi Hon, I hope you are doing good. I just made this quick little video so that I could demonstrate what I have been doing with this small application. So this is a very simple application that displays the list of products and uh, allows us to add the uh, products in the shopping cart and then we could add and remove and update the quantities likewise. So this is a simple. Uh, I've used a data list control to display the, the quantities uh, and if you wish to view the uh, the product we can always go and click on the item and uh, it will display the product this is just a simple uh, product page this is just a demo and uh, now our shopping cart is empty it has no item and uh, there's no amount because our shopping cart is empty so we will just add this one in the shopping cart and it comes back to us saying that the item has been successfully added uh, in the cart now we have one uh, quantity and if you wish to go and view the item in detail we can do that like so and uh, now we have a, we have the uh, product detail here now if, if you want to view the uh, the image in full size you can just uh, click on the image and it will display the image in a full uh, full view I'm, I've just used a light box uh, technology this is just a JavaScript file that I've included uh, and uh, now if you this is just uh, light box this is uh, some file that I've used and now here uh, if you wish to uh, we can always uh, update the quantity let's say the quantity now is 1 and if we change this one to 2 and hit the update quantity it will uh, come back to us and I've used the JavaScript technology it will come back to us uh, uh, with the uh, update progress Saying that the quantity has been updated. Similarly, I have used the validation here. So if you instead of instead of two, if you just write the value, let's say two y or some other invalid value, it will uh, say that enter a valid quantity. If you just enter, let's say null or nothing, it will say enter a quantity. So the validation has been taken care of here. Uh, so we'll just enter three and we'll just update the quantity and it will uh, update that and we can always go and continue shopping and similarly I have some uh, uh, added some uh, simple uh, uh, simple page here about us and contact us just a simple page and I've used the uh, site map uh, it tells us where we are inside the hierarchy of the website uh, and here I have used the data list control if you go back here uh, and I've used master pages. This is the uh, the master page that I've used, and I've used the uh, script manager inside the master page that will allow us to have uh, the AJAX technology throughout our website. Uh, then what we have here is uh, if you go to the uh, let's say here, here I've used the uh, the data list control that displays all the items. I, I've I've I'm, I've just used the data because to populate the data list. And to populate the grid view, I just had to have the data. So it's coming from the data actually, and it is coming with the pictures and with the amount and everything. So and I have used uh, three columns: one, two, and three. That's why it's displaying that in three, and it looks a little bit neat and clean. But this is just a small demo. We could have done even even better than this. So uh, now we can just you know go and uh, do that. And here I've used the uh, the grid. Uh, the grid view. Uh, if you go to the, to the shopping cart page here, uh, grid view that is. So this is the grid view that I've used, and uh, it will just tell you that quantity. This is the AJAX technology, and this is the site map part that I've. Uh, used here so that was uh, that was it uh, and I have the uh, I've just used the user control that displays the summary of the shopping cart and I have the uh, the CSS folder that has the CSS file uh, the classes I have written that here uh, then we have the image for displaying the large image and displaying the thumbnail the thumbnails are stored in the small uh, folder here so that was it uh, so this is now the website that has the functional uh, shopping guard that can add, edit and uh, remove the, the quantities from the, 
from the upside and I've used the ASP.NET 3.5 uh, technology that is the .NET framework so that was a small quick little video about uh, the shopping cart website I hope you liked it please do let me know if you have uh, if you have any, uh, any any feedback on this thank you